Karens are everywhere. So you best believe we have the greatest videos for you. You better get ready because we definitely have clips of the craziest Karen. In the first video, we found the perfect Karen. Blonde hair, the Karen hairstyle, the Karen clothes, everything. Look, 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 look. It's a like level 49 Karen. That is a high level Karen right there. Look at that hair. It's like super sane. She's already a level 49 Karen, and legend has it that if she shuts down one more restaurant, she levels up. In the next video, a Karen randomly bursts open another man's door because she said he was at the wrong side of the road. He was only trying to back up and fix his parking, but Karen was too eager to call the cops on him. You know that you're on the wrong Get side. Get out of my car. You're on the wrong side of the road. Okay, you're being filmed. Do you know that you're on the wrong? You think you're on the wrong side of the road. You're on the wrong side of the road. This is not Europe. You drive on the right side. Get out of my face, please. Get, the cops are coming. Great. Get out of my face. You're on the wrong side of the road. Do get, you know that you're on the wrong side of the road? Do you know that you're on the wrong side of the road? Please back away from Why my car. Why are you on this side of the road? Can you please back away from my car? Why are you on this side of the road? I was backing up. You're going to get a ticket okay, for driving I, on the wrong great. side of the road. Great. I was backing out of this space. You're on the wrong side of the road. How do you you're want- You're on the wrong side of the road. Okay. Okay. You cannot drive on this side of the road. <laughs> okay. Why, why are you don't, laughing? Don't touch my... my... Why are you laughing? The next Karen cuts the wire off a lift for workers who were trying to install something in the neighborhood. And they got it all on camera. This could have caused some serious injuries. She got arrested immediately after that. In the next video, a Karen and Kevin tandem are hysterical because their neighbors are wearing swimsuits while swimming. They're mad that that's all they can see. But who told them to spy on their neighbors in the first place? It's a family home. Oh, it's a family home. Yeah, it is okay. a family home. Yeah. Okay, that's good to know. Yeah, it's a family yeah. home. Okay. But also, what, what, was, the, what was the thing about when from, there was a Edmonton. swim shorts over there? What was the problem? Do I need to be staring at underwear? Well, it why are you looking shorts? at the house, though? Why what? It's why, outside uh, her window, man. Why now. am I looking yeah. at the house? I eat dinner right there staring yeah, at underwear. Look, look, look at somewhere the other else? Yeah. Wrong answer. You're telling okay. me to look somewhere else Listen. when I've lived here longer okay. than you guys? But no, why, now I'm Do pissed. I look at your now house? I'm pissed. No, do I look at your house? You know though? what? You guys, you guys never come outside. We do. You never. Well, yeah, like, when we're going to bed and my son's outside saying you guys Just are out there talking and I told him to okay. say, shut up. This is this is a private neighborhood. Keep, keep, keep okay. recording it. Yeah, I'm recording it. Because Think you know what? This. Now I'm calling the cops. There's a lot of people you're pissing go off. Okay. Trust me. Yeah. Trust me. There's a lot of people no, you're pissing now off. Now you there. piss me off. So I'm sorry. No, I just wanted to ask you about what was going on here. So yeah, after that incident that happened, uh, we ended up calling the cops and reporting them for harassing us and yelling at us. Um, but, well, we can't really do much right now. The next Karen thinks she's all that. She interrupts a music video because she believes they're trespassing. But get this, the actual owner of the property isn't even mad about what the people are doing. Excuse me, sir. I phoned up, and I'm going, they asked me to phone the city tomorrow, and the city's going to check if you had a permit. Yeah, that's great. My husband that's works wonderful. for the fire department, and when that's, I get that's back... That's great. If we have a fire, we'll give you a call. Well, but you're also trespassing on his property now, right where he's standing, yeah, where that do. that guy in the in the hoodie. There's a gate. No, but it goes. Property. No, no, no. But it goes. Property. Property. We, we appreciate your concern. Well, we'll he's right there. Right there. there. Right there. Thank you so much for your Have a great day. Thank no, you. no, 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 no. I'm gonna have a great day, but you know what? The next victim of a Karen wasn't having any of it. Karen and her husband complained that their food took too long to arrive. The McDonald's employee didn't cut Karen some slack and did something totally unexpected. You'll surely laugh out loud. Sorry, do you know that we've been waiting like 25 minutes for this food? Huh? We've waited like 25 minutes for this food. What do you want me to do? I don't know, like... Like, work fast. Some stuff? free juice or something. Yeah, like give us some anything. free food or something. Happy manager. I'm new employee. No, but like, no, no, but we expect I'm something free. Uh, the food for free or something, you know what I mean? Yeah, give yeah. us some free food. <laughs> you, must, you must think it's a joke. You want this food for free? 
What do you think this is? <laughs> Charity. <laughs> Take a food, please. I don't have time. I don't have time. We've been waiting for the food for like 25 minutes. 25 minutes. 25 minutes you I don't know. care. You can be waiting for 10 hours. I don't care. Oh, you, you don't, don't care? Yeah, we can tell that you don't care. Yeah, well, don't you care, don't, don't care. care. Do you know what yeah, customer services? Yeah, yeah, I don't, don't care. care. Do you know what customer services? What's he doing against me? What's he doing? Zoom in on his face. What is he doing? You think he wants to be paying against me? Wow, McDonald's. What? UK what? McDonald's. This is this is where that no, happened. Right. You, want, you want your burger? You want your burger? Collect it. Collect it. I don't care. Collect it. In the next video, we see a different breed of Karen. She's actually scared of viruses, and she kept talking about the six-foot law wherein everybody should be six feet away from each other. So she blocks everyone passing by her. Do you? I don't want to... Where's your mask? I don't... It's irrelevant. It's irrelevant. I want whatever drugs I'm not interested in going to the hospital and... ...because of you. Back up. I'm done. Can you please get what you're getting so I can finish grocery shopping? As soon as you back up, might do you some good to go do some other shopping and maybe by the time you get back here, you'll have plenty of room. Back up. I need security. We're trying to get rid of you. She won't let us through. I'm not, look, there's a six foot law and they're trying to get within my six foot range and I'm not gonna let them do it till I'm done I'm selecting what I wanna select. Down. No, I can't because they get within my six foot when they go by. No, I can't. They can either back up or they can go do some other shopping and come back when I'm done. Okay, I'll go get management. You ain't doing nothing but confronting me, all right? You're the aggressive here, not me. We were literally just trying to go down the aisle. Like I said, there's a six foot law. You ain't literally trying to do nothing but make me sit and go to the hospital. I'm fully vaccinated if that makes you feel it's better. It's irrelevant because it mutated, honey. Don't act like you're stupid. You know exactly what you're doing. Ma'am. What? If you want everybody to stay away from you, that's fine. Now, we're not allowed to have the Okay? I didn't no Yes, you did. Okay, I'll just yeah. lay it one more question for you. I don't have freedom of speech around here. Sweetheart, it's all being polite. Okay? Yeah, they're going to You think that's polite? They're not going to you? If they got some kind of COVID that's mutated, sweetie, sweetie, why aren't you wearing a mask if you're so worried? Because I've been vaccinated, but it's irrelevant because the COVID mutated. Right, right. So honey. I could still get it. So I just honey. want people to back up. Well, sweetheart, don't cuss them and be polite and let them shop. Don't stand in the middle of the aisle. Get over it. When I'm done selecting what I want to select, you need to they move over so our other customers can get back. Because this is not six feet. You need to move over so our other customers can get back. Woman, you want to go to jail sweetheart. today? You want to come back, sweetheart? Mm -hmm. You want to go to jail today? Excuse me. You're the one that grabbed a hold of my car. I moved please. your car like I asked you to move. Now, will you please get out of the middle of the aisle? You're fired. Help, I'm broke. You don't know who you're dealing with. I'm going to get my boss right now. You're fired. Why do Karens love grocery stores so much? The next Karen is screaming at customer service because she didn't want to wait in line with the rest of the people. And I want help. Okay. 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 Been where they are a mile long already. Soaking wet. Okay. No compassion. Who cares, right? I can tell I was going to go get yourself. If you were right. not stop right. Oh, thank you. I can see your face. You know what I'm saying. I said, let me do this. I'm going to get your stuff. So I'm not the after making a scene, she tries to ask for compassion from the other people in the store, which no one gave. And I think if anybody had compassion, you know I've been in a long line already. Not compassion for people who are yelling at customer service people. We have no compassion for people who are yelling. There's no help over there. Where do you go? We patiently wait in line until we can be helped. Then that's on you. Let's see you do it. I'm not afraid of water. Oh my God. Unacceptable. Why do Karens have to ruin everything good? The next Karen gets what she deserves after wrongfully defending her son. The two of them tried attacking a comedian and booing his jokes. They didn't expect what was coming their way. Yeah, but that's rude. Oh my God, now she's ganging up on me. Wait, you're his mother, so you're the reason for his atrocious behavior? <laughs> You never told him when all these teachers when all these teachers called you and said your kid needs to shut up in class. You were like, it's okay, Jeffrey. You would have whatever the f you want. 
Do I feel good? I feel like an appropriately raised individual because my mom had ethics. Man, if only you got this upset with your children and then this stuff wouldn't happen. Well, in the next video, the Karen's kind of sketchy. She's so against her neighbors putting up a fence on their lawn, we wonder why she's so against it. Is she spying on them? You want to be a tough neighbor, and I'm going to be tough back. I want them off my lot, and you're not putting anything there. Tough the fencing is being replaced at your husband. You know what? I, I'm, you know what? You created nothing but crap with all your picture taken. We're cutting down, down trees, which actually ultimately helped you. All right? We, we see took back your property for you because it was creating so many leaves and everything. What are you taking pre- I'll call the cops. My husband told me to call the cops. You want me to do that? Yes, and I will show him where the property money is. You don't even are. have, you have no idea where the property line is. Well, you don't know what you're speaking about. You don't either, because you weren't here when it was put in. You have not, you weren't here when it was put in, okay? Or you weren't old enough to know. Don't even Ma'am, go there. You don't know what you're you saying. You don't even know what you're talking about. You can't be a neighbor and take pictures and make my life difficult when I want to cut down trees and then do this. You're so full of crap. God, you've got me so mad right now. Well, that's what you get for being a neighbor. That's what you get. You get what you give. This is what your you husband... You get what you get. You know that? I wouldn't have said boo to you, but you want to be a neighbor and sit out here and take pictures and video while we're sitting there trying to cut down trees and all you can do is sit there and complain. Your neighbor, your own neighbor has been assigned are really man's best friend. This Karen is a solicitor trying to sell something to her neighbor when a dog suddenly sniffed her. Of course, she got offended. Who gets offended by dogs? Hello. 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 Hi, how are you? My name's Veronica. Nice to meet you. Oh, sorry. sorry. That was really rude. Sorry. Have you let him do that to me? No, I, I didn't. I, I'm, I'm not, I don't even know who you are, man. No, I'm sorry. See, I'm not kind of dog, but like... No, you, you're super <laughs> I love these kind of dogs, but... It's okay. Uh, you know what? It's have a nice Okay, cool. Come on, Z. The next Karen was definitely on something because she kept saying nonsense. She's looking for the owner of the house because she claims that she's a tax fraud investigator and she wants to kick them out. Uh, who are you? Investigator from the California State Board of Equalization. Okay, so, so who are do you, you looking for? Do you own this property? Are you the owner? Are you looking for? I'm looking for the owner of the property. Well, then I'm pretty sure if you're the tax fraud investigator for the state of California that you'll know how to find a property owner. If you're not the tenant on the lease, then I'm going to have the police out here and have you removed in, in two days. You understand? <laughs> you're funny. Are you you're laughing at me? It will be reported. So you're it doesn't video. matter. Well, it doesn't we'll matter. We'll see what the police say. It doesn't matter. Well, this house looks like it's got issues. You okay. Look like you have issues. And there's pro no. Something. Okay. Oh. Oh, something at your door. You've got squatters here at this property, and I'm going to prove to the police that you don't own it. Okay. You're a squatter. You're on my property. Get off of it. Uh, actually, you know what? I'm going to have you removed from this property in two seconds, and I've got your phone number out here and your son's card. And I'm going to make sure that he's doing no construction without a license. Handle your business. It seems like Karens always ask for store managers whenever they don't get what they want. This Karen made a scene in the middle of the store, screaming her lungs out for their manager because her card wouldn't work. Y'all, I've never seen a Karen before lol. And for the final Karen of the day, it's a Karen who ruins everyone's joy. She doesn't want these people to have a good time during their marathon, so she drives her car in the middle of the street while everyone's running. 
won't get out. Listen, you're breaking no, the law. I have tried to get out every it's which way, but you just don't have to wait here. I have a workshop in Oakhampton. I have had no information at what time I need to don't get be out. So stupid. Don't be so stupid. I went very slow. Don't you move. Stay there. Well, Turn you, see, you can find the workshop. Turn your engine on. Stay there. Stay there. I have tried every which way Stay to get out. There. I went very, very, very slowly. I didn't know what time I was supposed to be out of. I knew this was happening. Honestly, listen, I'm disabled. I find it hard. I've got a workshop in Oakhampton. I'm supposed to pick someone up already. You knew the road was being So what am I supposed to do? When am I supposed to be out by? Six o'clock in the morning? Well, what the hell? It takes me a long time to get ready.